In Chapter 17 of The Hobbit by J.R.R. Tolkien, the culmination of the group's adventures is marked by the dramatic unfolding of events leading up to the Battle of Five Armies. This chapter strikes a chord with its vivid depiction of diplomacy, betrayal, and the bloody skirmish that ensues, which collectively serve as a profound commentary on greed, loyalty, and the complexities of intercultural relations. As the chapter opens, we are presented with Bard, the grim bowman of Esgaroth, confronting Thorin Oakenshield with the Arkenstone, a gem of unparalleled beauty and the heart of the mountain's treasure. It is revealed that Bilbo Baggins, the unassuming hobbit and burglar of the company, has sneakily passed the stone to Bard as a means of brokering peace and ensuring fair distribution of the treasure. Thorin's vehement reaction to this revelation, marked by both disbelief and rage, encapsulates his deeply ingrained avarice and obstinacy, traits that have been slowly unraveling through their journey. The sudden appearance of Gandalf serves as a critical pivot in the narrative, not only unveiling Bilbo's tactical move, but also reinforcing the wizard's role as a mediator and a guiding force. Thorin's pledge to exchange the Arkenstone for a 14th share of the Horde reveals the inherent contradiction in his values. While he holds honor and oaths in high regard, his greed nearly leads him to forsake his promise. The tension escalates as Bard, bearing the Arkenstone, attempts to negotiate with Dane and his 500 dwarves, but rejects any passage that would bolster Thorin's stand against the Men of Dale and the Elves. The inevitable clash, known as the Battle of Five Armies, pits the Elves, Men, and Dwarves against the malicious forces of goblins and wargs. Tolkien's depiction of the battle is not only a spectacle of fantasy warfare, but also a heartbreaking reflection on the futility and devastation wrought by conflict. The Eagles' arrival echoes their earlier intervention, symbolizing a divine or natural intervention that often plays a critical role in Tolkien's narratives. It is during this chaos that Bilbo is struck unconscious by a stone, a moment that symbolically ends his active participation in the quest and harks back to his simpler life in the Shire, a life far removed from battles and heroics. The analysis of this chapter reveals the intricate web of allegiances, betrayals, and the dire consequences of greed that Tolkien masterfully weaves. The Battle of Five Armies serves as a microcosm for the broader themes of The Hobbit, exploring the dual nature of heroism and cowardice, the complexity of peace negotiations, and the tragic toll of warfare. The event is a stark reminder of the book's overarching caution against material and personal gain at the expense of unity and peace, a message that resonates profoundly in the context of the socio-political climate leading up to World War II. Tolkien's narrative not only explores the age-old conflict between good and evil, but also delves into the shades of gray in between. It scrutinizes the motivations of its characters, the historic enmities and alliances that shape their actions, and the often ambiguous nature of valor and honor. This chapter, with its blend of high fantasy and poignant realism, encapsulates the enduring allure and depth of The Hobbit, making it not only a tale of adventure, but a timeless reflection on the human condition. Thanks for watching this bookly crash course video. Make sure to check out my channel for the complete chapter-by-chapter -chapter summary playlist.